Hey guys, I'd just like to ask if you could like and subscribe and comment on the video with any thoughts you might have had because it goes a long way towards helping support my channel. Thank you. Hello and welcome back to God's Basement, where we are very much not in a basement. Uh, so I, there was a crazy woman trying to chase me that I think is my grandmother, but you know, maybe, maybe I'll find out that's actually been my mother the whole time. We'll see. But I got the security card that's supposed to take me to the uh, right side of this section. Oh look, nothing scary waiting for me in here. Nothing in there. Oh, I never even noticed this. Well, can't go in there, so that's cool. I'm in. Yeah, what is this stuff I keep seeing on the ground? Is it like, what is that? <laughs> that white thing, is it? Is it supposed to be a fork? Typically forks aren't just one solid object. Alrighty. Oh, that's nice. Hello? Oh, good, it's the bunny. Can I pick it up? No. Can I interact with anything here? There's a page. Dear mother, how have you been? I've been, it's been pretty hectic over here balancing family and work. James is about half a year old now and he's growing healthily. I have some bad news. I might have to relocate to another state because of my job in the next few months. I don't know for sure yet, but there's a high probability of the relocation. I know I promised to let you see your grandson. I really intend to let you see him, but it's difficult to find the time. I'll keep you updated on everything. Your son, Neil Young. Ah. Uh, yeah, my, my theory is that the grandmother kidnapped James. And he's now finding out. Either he knew about it, and these are just refreshing his memories, or he's finding out about it for the first time. Okay. The only survivor was the grandmother of the infant child. Although she suffered major injuries, she these lights are going wild. Authorities also reported What's that the thing? grandfather was driving the vehicle and that alcohol might have been involved in the incident. Uh huh. Hi. Look at her just wigging out. Oh, there she went. She in here with me? No. So just like my childhood boy. Okay, I can't go through there. Is there going to be a baby in here? Hey, whoa, 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 don't do that. Bad. Stop that. Stop that. Am I supposed to interact with this? Is there a baby in a box? So I'll have you know that that's not typically how you take care of children. Grandma, what secrets are you hiding? What did you do? Did you kidnap me as a child? Grandma? Okay, we're through that area. I'm, I'm not going to stand for this, Grandma. James, it has been some time since I've last seen you around. Not that long. By now... You should have some idea of the history between your grandmother and your parents. Uh-huh. After the accident occurred, there was extreme tension between them. Okay. It was understandable given the context know, they, of the situation. They... Your parents wanted some space due to the grief they were experiencing. I think she your was feeling though. Dealing with the guilt and loneliness. Long and grief. Support and forgiveness. Something your parents did not grant. 
I promise we'll get to your part of the story soon. To satisfy your curiosity for a bit, Ooh. I'll tell you a small truth about God's basement. Okay, okay, what is it? God's basement is a place to reflect on your past life. That statement might be a bit broad, but I'll tell you more as you continue your journey. As for this area, there seems to be a locked door with a keypad. Uh, yeah, it seems I'm to be. I'm sure you'll figure it out. <laughs> I'll see you around soon. Good luck. Dude just said, hey, look over there, there's a keypad. I'm sure you can work with that. <laughs> but yeah, the thing I'm confused about, though, is like, if it's about to reflect on my life, I haven't done anything in this story yet. You know, it's all been my parents and grandma and the accident that happened with grandpa and, um, and infant brother. Like, w what, what's my part in this? Because I imagine being raised by my grandma that something separated me from the parents, right? We got separated. Which, my suspicion right now is that Grandma stole me away. I was kidnapped. So this door, that just goes back to the old area, right? Yeah, I don't think I can go through there. That's just, that's just saying that's where you came from. So is there going to be a code somewhere? Oh, hold on, there's something. One of six? What do you mean, one of six? Two of six? Oh, boy. Wait, have I missed something? Hold on, just check it. Okay, yeah, I did. There was another one back here. Three of six? Oh, boy. Five of six, oh nine eleven. Do I need the last piece? Because it seems like I have everything I need now. But yeah. So like, what is my my stake in all this? Like, what did I do? Oh, it's right there. Five of six. Wait, what? But I had five of six. There was an imposter paper among them. Are they all in here, or should I check the other room, too? I thought I had six. What? Oh, there we go. Six of six. So yeah, what is my stake in all this? What did I do that I have to reflect on here? It's so all this so far, if it's about my life that I'm reflecting on, it seems like backstory. Oh, nine, one, one. Uh, where did I enter? Correct. Achievement unlocked. Hacker. Yeah, I did a whole lot of hacking there. There's a box. Grandma, can we stop with the bunny? Hello? Nothing over there. Can't open that. Can't open that. Can't play with the bunny. Can I go back? I can go back. But why? Is there something else back here now? Or did I just waste a trip? Grandma, do something spooky. Fine. There's a box again. Maybe I'm supposed to like lay out the paper? 
can't go into here for whatever reason. It's just a bunny. Oh, there's another paper. Can I see him? Oh. No, you can't. That, that's the thing. Turn off the light, maybe? Is that the key? Let's say hi. I'm gonna try heading back now that I've seen that. I'm gonna go with my light out. So I think that's the key. So I have to go in the darkness. You can't see me. No? Okay. Well, I thought that was going to be the key. <laughs> oh, blup, blup, whoops. The only other thing I can think of is that maybe there's some way to turn out the light. Can I see him? Oh, there it goes. But yeah, I really think that she kidnapped the kid. Oh, when did you get down there? Yeah, she kidnapped the kid. And I don't know what else... What my part in all it is. Because, like... I'm already a decent chunk of this game. It's not that long. It's like two and a half hours. Hey. Grandma. Calm down, Grandma. Grandma. Yeah, it seems to be more reflecting on her life than mine. I'm in. I didn't realize the zoom-in mechanic would be such a heavy part of this game. Oh boy. Is it on a dark hallway or into this room? Oh. Grandma. What are you doing? Start, Grandma. Oh, there she went. Oh, what? Is she in here? Hold on, where? What? I, I was zoomed in. Okay, I, I, that explains a lot. I was like, I can't see shit. Hello? Yo! Oh, yeah, she definitely kidnapped him. Bruh, she murdered them and then took the baby? Bruh, that's so fucked up. I don't know if I'm supposed to stay here or move on yet. Trying to keep an eye out for. Oh, hello. Oh, it's the cops. I still don't know what that has to do with me, though. Well, I, obviously, it has a lot to do with me, but I mean, like, what are. Why am I repenting on my life if, like, I'm still just a baby for all this? I didn't do shit. Okay, I think I could move on now. It's a really tight pathway here. Oh, close on tone. Thank you, Grandma. Oh boy. Is that light about to go out? Yep, there it goes. Now, uh, which direction should I go? 
Honestly, probably towards the scene of the crime, right? Nope. That one went dark. So do I just pick a direction now? <laughs> then should be like, nope. Nope, not that one. Well, that just leaves here. Nope, that one going dark too. Okay. You know, I'm, I'm just going to wait here for her to approach. Alright, Grandma, it's nice and dark. What are you going to do now? I see her. I don't know what I can do about this. I don't know if I can really go around her or anything. Oh, hello. Did I lose? Or is that supposed to happen? Okay, I think that was supposed to happen. That would be funny, though, if I just lose a walking simulator. So yeah, Grandma went and killed my parents. James, I hope you're okay. That looked like it probably hurt. Wait, what did you even do? What do you mean it looked like it probably hurt? Yeah, it looks like it. I also have some more good news. Probably gonna turn to PT though. You're going to be exploring your early childhood memories. Oh boy. For the most part. You were raised by your grandmother. A good chunk of your memories have manifested themselves in the form of journal entries. Of course. Read those carefully as they represent your thoughts and emotions at the time. Okay. You probably thought you'd be stuck in that dimly lit, creepy office area forever. At least you're getting a change of scenery. Yeah, that's pretty cool. God's basement tends to manifest itself in an unusual way. The more you remember about your childhood, the creepier things can get. Okay. Remember when I asked you to ignore anything unusual? Well, that was just a joke. Of course it was. It's obviously there's Funny no joke, reason. man. Funny joke. The only reason I said that was to frighten you. I find it quite amusing. <laughs> Well, I should probably wrap this model. Dude up. said, "See, the truth is, I'm actually just an asshole." Your past. And one last thing. Good luck. <laughs> this dude really just said, "Um, yeah, actually, yeah, that, that creepy stuff is gonna happen regardless. I'm just a dick." A brutal crime scene emerged this weekend within a quiet suburban neighborhood. Two victims, Neil Young and Sarah Young, were viciously stabbed by an unknown assailant. Two parents leave an infant son behind. Authorities do not have a lead. It was reported that each victim was stabbed over 30 times, resulting in the faces of the victims to be heavily distorted and mangled. This brutal crime has, so has shocked the local community, resulting blank. Alright, give me just a moment. I need to pull something up. That fits the uh, fits fits what was just said. Just a moment. I'm gonna play a little bit of sound for this. It's, it's kind of necessary. Y'all hear it?
28 stab wounds in the chest. Wait, hold on. Here's a short version. 28 stab wounds. <laughs> okay, that one sounds really good. Let me leave a like on that one. Okay. Uh, let me make it back to the game. Okay. <laughs> All right. Grandma, why are you gonna be locked in here? Grandma? Am I supposed to find my journal? Where is it? Oh, hold on. Can you hear white noise? The sound of silence. Can you turn off the TV? Something outside my window, maybe? Was all this here before? Maybe I need to be silent for a certain amount of time? Hello, Mr. Owl. Oh, TV turned off, but it's still going. I am guessing... Nope. Okay. Okay. Why does it look like the door's opening on there? Okay, that's concerning. Grandma? Grandma? By the way, I'm pretty sure I've seen the model for the grandma before. I'm pretty sure that's been used in plenty of other horror games, but it's hard for me to remember for sure. Grandma's been acting strange lately. She seems to be very forgetful and misplaces a lot of her belongings, like her car keys and medication. It was my birthday last week, but she forgot that too. I'm going into middle school pretty soon, so I'm nervous, a bit nervous about that. I hope she starts getting better soon. So are her car keys just going to be somewhere? Grandma, you're so forgetful. You forgot these apples. Well, that's cool. Grandma's acting strange again. Recently I've been finding random letters on all the pictures and paintings we have hung up. It's always just one red le letter randomly drawn inside of a painting. I asked her about it, she said she doesn't remember writing the letters. Of course not. So, uh... No red letter there. Why why do you just have the same painting and like <laughs> Who decides their house like this? Well you see, I just really love that skyline. <laughs> Not seeing any red letters, though. I took that picture and I said, you know what? I'm never going to find a better picture than that one. So I hung it up 28 times in my house. Uh, no red letter. It's probably in here. But, yeah, white noise, yeah. No red letter. Seriously, just, she just hung up this same picture, like, a million times. Yeah, where's the should-be-red letter somewhere? I don't know how helpful finding it will be, but it's, it's here somewhere. Probably down in the bottom, honestly. It'd be within easy view, I imagine. Oh, there we go. M. I found M. Just 
So what what about that? That still doesn't say anything. I found M. What what does finding M mean? Which painting was it on? Might be on multiple paintings actually. So the M is right there. So nothing. 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 Okay, so just the M. Will I be able to move on now? Just because I saw the M? Am I even able to put that anywhere? Okay, still can't open that. No red letters. There's no other paintings in here, right? Just that one? Okay. And this one obviously doesn't have a red letter. But I don't know where I'd even put a red letter. What what does seeing the red M mean? Like what am I even gonna do with that in fact? Maybe I need to mess with this painting now? Oh there it goes. Okay. I had to zoom in on the letter specifically, okay. Does this one say something now? M. Do I have to find the rest of them now, too? Wait, there was a painting here, wasn't there? There's paintings missing now. Nothing. Nothing. Maybe I can open this door now? No. I feel like I need to find more letters, but none of them... I couldn't see any. Gotta be something I'm missing here. Hold on. Keep looking, squad. May I must be just blind to some letter that I should have seen already. All right, there we go, there we go. E. Alright. E. U. So it was like right by the, the frame of the painting. I couldn't see it. Alright, it's probably up somewhere. No. Alright, let me look at the message right now. Mew. Uh, Mew. It's just talking about Mew. Pokemon 151. Mew. Eventually it'll become Mewtwo. So yeah, writing letters on all your paintings is kind of a weird habit, gotta say. Was that always there? It's a really weird habit, Grandma, gotta say. Alright. Nothing there. Take a moment, look at all the corridors, look everywhere, nothing there. Nothing. 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 Because it seems like the letters are a bit, oh, there we go, R. Murder, is it gonna be murder? Yeah, it's gonna be murder. You murdered them, Margaret.
guess the only question is, am I complicit? Look a bit closer. It's going to be a D and an E. Keep an eye out for those. Let me look at this one again, because this one's kind of big. Maybe we finally go upstairs? Anything? No. What's around somewhere? Hold on. I mean, I already know what the word's gonna say. It's just a matter of finding the letter. How am I doing on time? Oh, there it is. Hold on. D. He's nuts, Grandma. Ha 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 ha. The kids at school taught me that. It should just be an E left. Hold on. Oh, an R left. Okay, hold on. There's another R. Okay, let me check the paintings up top. But this might be the one that's finally in those paintings upstairs. If not, I'll have to go back through these paintings again for the millionth time. Door won't open still. Nothing. Yeah, you'd think the, it would stand out more, but those letters are kind of hard to see against the painting. Maybe it's just me. But maybe y'all been like screaming at me this whole time like, it's right there, Dora. Oh, some of them I've been able to spot like immediately, some of them I just haven't. <laughs> oh, but this one's very obvious. <laughs> I don't know how I didn't see that earlier. In other news, last weekend, a brutal crime was committed in a quiet suburban neighborhood. Grandma. The two victims were a young couple, recently turned parents that were viciously stabbed while sleeping inside their bedroom. While sleeping? Oh, Authorities Grandma. reported that the bodies were mutilated to the point of being unrecognizable. The two also left behind an infant son. Currently, there are no suspects or leads as to who committed the murder, but authorities are adamantly investigating the situation. Grandma. The hell? I felt like I couldn't go up the stairs for a moment. Grandma, why did you turn off the lights? You know it's gets hard to see, right? Grandma? What are you doing, Grandma? Did you draw on these paintings too? Hold on. Oh, they're just being weird. Yeah, I'm not seeing any. Wait. Oh, is that part of the painting, or is that blood smears? Grandma, are you back here? No? Okay. Had to check. Wait. Okay, I thought it was, like, almost going in for a moment. I'm like, hold on. Something's actually happening. Like a light on the other side. Grandma, what are you up to? Oh, I didn't read this note. Hold on. Something really strange is happening with Grandma. She doesn't seem like herself. She feels very distant and less lively. She doesn't enjoy talking as much as she used to. She seems very quiet. Like, she's always thinking about something. Fortunately, her habit of forgetting things isn't getting any better. She frequently forgets to take her medication, so I just have to remind her very often. Hope her condition improves. 
Again, I'm not sure why it's a reflection of James' life. Like, even this deep in the game, I'm not sure why it's about him. So, like, if it's about her, what she did, the grandma, then that'd make more sense. So, unless he, like, murdered his grandma, or, like, was complicit in this in some way, then I don't know. I don't get it. Grandma, open up one of the doors, please. Maybe I need to, like, zoom in. That's not really doing anything. Um, oh, I could welcome home. Thank you. Thank you, Grandma. Oh, Grandma! Hey! How you doing, Grandma? It... That's kind of concerning. Grandma, you know that chair is kind of moving on its own, right? That's a little weird. Am I supposed to go look at this? Nothing? Or can I see this from back here? Oh! Interesting. That's weird. Nothing yet. And I like zoom in on where Grandma is. Oh. Is she holding a knife? No, she's not. Okay, is she gonna be there now? No. Grandma, what are you doing? There it is. Number eight. Recently, my grandmother has been acting strange. Oh. I've been waking up in the oh, middle I did not look at what the that uh. I usually find her that achievement was. Back and forth aimlessly. She usually won't even notice I'm there until I make my presence known. After she notices Wait. me, she, she gives me this blank expression. I glance down at my phone for just the briefest moment she's gone. Sometimes I'll press my ear against her door, and I'll hear a distorted version of this classical uh -huh. song she always listened to. Although these incidents are rare, they still creep me out. It happens about once every few months. Hopefully she gets better. Yeah, I hope so. Okay, well I'm gonna stop there, and I'll see you all next time in what should be the final video for God's Basement. Bye. Thank you for watching. If you liked what you saw, please leave a like and comment and subscribe to the channel for more content. Thank you.